Web-based lookup, an integrated feature in Team Server. Web-based lookup consists of a web page that is linked to Team Server for any professionals involved in translation projects to look up a term, a segment, or a whole sentence in all the databases in a single search. With web-based lookup, reference terminology and translations are available anytime. First, we need to define the people involved in the translation project. The administrator or project manager will be represented by this icon throughout the demonstration. Translators, proofreaders and reviewers will be represented by this icon. Finally, the happy end client is represented by this icon. As a start, let's log into Team Server as an administrator. Here is the administrator control panel, from which the administrator sets everything up. The Team Server administrator maintains a user list of everyone who's been provided an access to the web based lookup. To do so, he assigns each of them a username and a password when they are first entered in the system. For the sake of this presentation, we will now create a new project manager. The number of users having access to the lookup is unlimited. For flexibility and confidentiality purposes, the Administrator Control Panel also makes it easy for the Administrator to set full or limited access to the web-based lookup. By activating the Limited Access option, the Administrator prevents the user from seeing information about clients and usernames in the web-based interface. It is an easy and sure way to ensure confidentiality. The administrator can also restrict the search results according to certain languages, clients, projects or subjects in the memory. Now let's have a look at what happens from the user's point of view. Any user with an internet connection can access the web-based lookup. He simply needs to enter the lookup address he was provided with and log in as shown. Here I'm logging into the database as a project manager with full access. A single search will provide complete results from both the term base and translation memory with all their attributes as we'll show you now. First, the user selects source and target languages. Then he types a term. He can apply different filters to his search if necessary. Let's have a look at the various attributes. Context, client and subject information is available. It is very easy to add a synonym, an antonym, a definition, or any other useful information from the Deja Vu X2 term base. If the term has various possible translations, different filters can easily be applied. Results can be displayed by project, client, user, subject, and date. The term room has many occurrences in the term base. Let's imagine we are working on a specific project. By applying the project filter, the user can get the appropriate translation for his project. Thus, terminology consistency is ensured throughout the whole translation process. At any moment, the occurrences for the term being searched can be displayed in one click. In the Concordance window, we can access context information. From here, 
the user can see what the previous and following segments are for the concordance he looked for. In the search window, the user can also scan the team server databases for segments. In the translation memory window, he can consult the matching score, see different context details, look for concordances, and display the result in its original context. The user can also look up simple portions. If the translation memory contains his request, context details will be available too. Now, let's have a look at the interface and information available for a user with restricted rights. Let's log in with the restricted client access as defined earlier by the administrator. Other clients or user lists cannot be seen from the main page. Since this client has the right to access the advertising and marketing results only, doing a search in the lookup only shows the items related to this subject. Of course, results available in the lookup are updated in real time when users are sending terms and segments to the team server database. Here, the translator is sending a term to the team server term base. As you can see, it is instantly available on the web-based lookup since it was sent and stored in the term base in real time. That means any professional involved at any stage of the translation process can consult the databases they have been granted access to. Thus, they are able to obtain valuable information as they work, wherever they work, regardless of the CAT tool they use, and even if they don't use one. Web-based lookup, the way to maximize consistency, quality, and productivity. Find more e-learning modules on www.atril.com.